Alright, welcome back to part three of my normal mode playthrough uh, on story mode. Hopefully I don't screw up like last time. I think I uh, went through the playthrough of that again. Um, I don't think I actually stole from one of the uh, guards, which was unfortunate. Also probably should have... Um, once I knew I screwed up, I should have uh, had my other guy back up rather than go for the guard in the corner. Anyways, um, this level is the first that's on very guard. What usually happens here is um, the uh, the difficulty can increase in. Uh, usually one of two ways. Either the the programs, the uh, firewalls themselves have uh, something called daemons, which um, which causes bad things to happen if they get broken, or the guards get more armor. One of the, one of the two. Um, we'll see which ones. I prefer the guards getting more armor, just because it's actually not that bad to uh, screw around guards, but those Damien's can really suck. Um, Alright, this guard, I'm not sure what he's doing. He looks to be stationary. I was here, if he had walked, I probably would have heard him, so I'm assuming he's stationary. He, I can't really open this door um, because he'd probably walk in here, so I'm just going to go around here. Uh, spend a coin to... Uh, no, not worth it. I could have uh, broken that one firewall uh, with one parasite that last turn, but I'm not gonna bother. Alright, so I will force him to walk this way. He's gonna pat here, take a look around, and then come right back. Um, I might actually... Hmm. I wonder if I should go over here. That actually seems reasonable. Uh, and have this guy get that. Yeah. Actually, I'm not sure I can reach. Yeah, I can't reach it. I could walk this guy over here. I have enough. I have enough movement. And he's gonna when he checks, he's not actually gonna um, see this area. Uh, if I get here, I have two extra movement, so I can spot here. I can't actually open this door because then he actually would check that. So yeah, this thing has a Damien, which sucks. Um, let me think. I could just tempt fate and, and uh, see what that Damien is. Oh sweet, I get some ammunition. Um, but I don't think I really want to. Uh, which one's closer? One, two, three, four. One, two, three. Doesn't really matter. Okay. Do I want to break this thing? Um. Sure. Oh, yeah. This guy. Yeah, that's cover. That doesn't look like it might provide cover, but it does. All right. So that's one of the worst. Uh, what? One of the least worst demons. Um. Just losing two action points for a couple turns does not really make a big difference. Um, where does she want to go? I think Deckard. Uh, she has space, so I would prefer her to go to a place where she can find something to 
find things, something to uh, find a firewall to put a parasite on, but no such luck. Uh, move this guy back. He's gonna actually. He might actually see me, so I'm gonna go here. And that should be good. I did not notice that he has. He's actually looking this way. He did not see that, so he's actually gonna try peek around here again. So I need to hide. Um, but Deckard, he has enough movement to wander around here. I will. Hmm. Probably go for this thing right here. And then come back for this thing if I need it. Must be a match. That's a waste of time. I don't know why some of the guards seem to like to stand in a weird position at the end. Alright, um, So there's this dude. I'm actually just I'm just gonna hack the turret. Hacking the turret versus the power supply means you don't actually control um, whether or not it shoots. You normally don't want it to just randomly shoot at, at things, um, which is why you normally hack the power supply. But I hopefully I don't screw up and uh, cause someone cause one of the guards to go there. Alright, so uh, this is one of the random events that you can get when you hit a console. Uh, normally normally I will just quickly turn off because uh, the consequences of raising a tracker is a lot worse than the possibility that you get like you get sometimes get extra power if you try one of the other one other things. Alright, so he's gonna walk this way. Um, actually, I probably could have went over here and checked this door, this area. I still can. Wastes a lot of movement though. Alright, I'll just wait here. Oh my god, that guy, that guy was a pat, I believe. Alright. I should have actually, um, yeah, let's see, he walks up there. I should have uh, been more careful and actually have spotted his pat last turn. Alright, buddy. Another turret. Uh, yeah, again, I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna try to hack the power supply since it has a Damien on it. Um, here this thing is still in the process of being hacked. So I'm gonna swing around here. I actually don't have a passcode for for that area. So this it is. That guy is probably coming back this way next turn. Oh, lovely. Um, gosh darn it. I'm going to spin this guy around. Oh, shoot. I'm going to spin this guy around by going 
going here and then coming back and then exiting. Um, it'll take a couple turns though. Alright, so there was a couple of things here. I'm not sure. Hmm. So there was a pat here. In addition to there being. I think these guys are stationary. Uh, I can't get lock here. Because. Alright. This is bad news. Alright, so I can't actually steal this guy, which I'd like to do. This guy is probably going to go here, look around, and then come back. This guy will not come here. He's interested in the same spot, so once this guy checks it out, he's not going to actually do much. Um, I do want to steal from this guy, so... And I can't actually go here. Because I don't have a passcode. I could technically go over here, but this guy's gonna come swing around. So I'm just gonna hide here for the time being. Investigating the area. Alright, so this guy is right here, I believe. Oh whoops, I needed to hack this thing. Let's see if this guy has a passcode. He does not. He's gonna walk in here, open the door. Yeah, that's not good. I need to be undercover for that. Um, I'm pretty sure I can open. I'm pretty sure I can open here. He's standing right there. Yep. I'm gonna walk here to get this guy to get noticed here. So that he walks here, and then once he checks that out, he's gonna stand. He's gonna go back to here. At which point he's, he's he will be facing this direction. At that point, I can swing in and get the chest. Um, so there's that, and then I will be. Oh, whoops! I'll be going out here and swing over here. Oh, I should have stole from him. I'm not sure if... I'm pretty sure I did not steal right there. Or I have not stolen from him yet, so... Mistake. Yeah, that was a pretty big flub. So right, I think I can... I am gonna go over here. Oh god. That was a big flub again. Alright. I forgot that it takes him two turns to do this check. Alright. Alright, I can I can hide here. The question is how I'm gonna actually go over here. I might have needed to I think this guy is stationary here. I probably need to knock him out. Alright, but... Yeah, this has been a pretty, pretty poor, poor run so far. I don't feel as if there should be any more guards in this level, but... I could be wrong. Yeah. 
Let me see. I can't walk this way. I'll notice. Hopefully he walks this thing next turn. Okay. Is there anything I can do here? I think this door actually is a is a better way than uh, trying to go through this area. Oh, nice. Neuro Disruptor number three. That's a very good weapon. This thing needs a couple more turns. There might be some stuff over there. I'm going to have to check that out once this firewall gets cracked. So what it looks like will be happening is um, I'm definitely going to get another guard that I have to deal with for most of this mission. Alright, I need to steal this guy and not forget about it, not get screwed up. Please remember to steal... oh, <laughs> maybe I already stolen from him. I'm gonna have to swing around up here. So this guy is gonna go all the way over here. This probably connects this area. Probably the safer way of uh, traversing this. Um, I have enough movement so that if someone notices, um, it's fine. I I can uh, still run for cover. Hmm, I did not notice this door. Alright. That's kind of bad. This is also kind of bad. I'm going to have to hack this. Uh, obviously, I can't actually get anywhere near here until this thing gets broken. I could, and that'll take three turns. I could go over here with this guy. Um, and check out this door. Yep. At this point, I am just going to be moving like right next to these entrances um, because I need to sp speed this up. Alright, so this guy needs to go all the way over here. And this guy needs to actually go back around that loop around this way again because he can't actually open this door. I'm saving that Damien for the last because that Damien probably is gonna make everything a lot worse once it once it gets unlocked. Um question is whether or not I unlock it now. It, it does will, it will take me two turns to uh, to crack it. So I think next turn, yeah, I'm gonna put put parasite on it. this turn. All right, here's the next guard probably coming here. And when they spawn, they go hunting at a particular location, assuming that uh, I'm pretty sure that's what happened. They hunt 
uh, a, a location randomly. Um, if they don't find anything, then they'll s start patrolling um, one of two locations. Oh wow, there we go. Alright, good things these things don't have Damien's on them. Um, do I care to get this? He can walk. Yeah, that's fine. He's not going to be able to walk all the way over here. So, if he. I'm interested in where he's actually going to go. Oh my god, are you serious? That was one bad Damien. Uh, Alright. That means there's an extra guard next turn. Um, I don't know where that guy went. He, uh, he didn't go in... He must have went like in this area? I'm not sure. Alright, so if I open this door, this guy is actually going to walk this way. I'd r I want the other pat to come this way and open and check out this area. So I'm not going to open it just quite yet. Alright, um... Oh boy. Oh boy, this guy's gonna get killed. <laughs> and at that point, I think this guy will kill this turret for me, but that's not gonna be good. I don't need, I don't need the passcode on her. Alright, this guy's gonna check this out. And even though the security camera would also check it out, he's going to arrive first. So once he comes and he doesn't see anything, then um, the other guys will come, go back. It is unfortunate that I don't get to see what this area is, um, though. And it's also unfortunate this guy is about to die. Very much so. That raises you. Um, the more things that you kill, raises the cleanup costs. Um, so it's, there's a small, small cost to each of these deaths. Oh, I forgot to check out this area. I need to do that. Must be oh god. Yes, sir. Oh, these guys also go into really alert mode once that happens which is also really unfortunate. In any case, I need to get out of here. Um, let me see. Can I... I cannot. Oh boy, so... Where to move myself? I think I'll move... Uh, I wish this thing was unlocked. I can start using cloak. I can start using cloak. But uh, not quite yet. Not quite yet. Are you serious? Can you? Why do you not kill this guy? fair amount of cleanup costs. Um, yeah. 
Yeah. This is going to be tricky for me to get from here all the way over to here because I'm going to have to go around this area. Um, I will take a peek. And I have two action points that allow me to see where these guys are headed. Okay. So it doesn't look like they're headed to over here quite yet. Alright, they're all they're all over here. It's possible that this guy is gonna head this way. I don't think that's likely. So I'm gonna be stationary right here. Six action points to spend figuring out where these guys are hunting. Alright, a couple of them are going, or one of them is heading this way. The more important part is this guy, which has really high vision, is heading towards this way. If this guy comes across me, I'm really fucked. Um, Let's see. I'm going to try to spot where he is. I don't. I think he might be headed towards here. I'm not quite sure. But it looks a little unfortunate that I can't actually determine if I can. Um, I can't determine if I can open this door or not. I think I can. I think I can open here and walk over here. I think, yeah, I think that's what I'm gonna do. Oh lord. thought that thing said noticed, but not necessarily... Alright, it looks like I need to actually start walking like over here. I don't think I can get past this group that's in here. And they're gonna start searching this area. So I'm going to try to swing through here. This is going to be rough. Alright, this guy's head this way. This way is head that way. That guy's headed my way. very much towards this way. Um, I am actually going to just hide over here. I can run. I don't 
don't know if this thing gives me any sort of cover. Uh, this guy might just go go to his death over here. That guy's looking there. There's a guy over here. He might be swinging back, so I'm going to be careful about that and not be here. Hmm. It's possible that being here is safe, so I'm just gonna stay here. This thing, this thing, this security guy is a little scary for me. This is really bad. But regardless of how bad it is, I will endeavor to get out of this. This thing. Alright. That guy's going there. That guy is going there and he's going to get killed. That guy is hunting there for no good reason. And I'm pretty sure this guy... These guys, I'm pretty sure they'll walk, they'll try to walk around me and actually not spot me. I think. Yeah. I will try to hack this camera just in case I see something over there. thought that there was a... oh boy. This is really not good. This thing once once this guy hits this thing, I have to actually attack him. And then this guy probably will see, assuming this guy goes after him. Yep. Lucky for target. Lucky for target. Guard down.
I can actually start trapping him. Trapping them, I mean. In that area. Because they can't actually escape here if I put this dude right here. We'll see if I can do it. Um, this guy has my paralyzer. Okay. All right. Uh, I'm gonna. Do I? Can I run? Is the question. Would it make sense for me to run? Yeah. So there's a guy here looking this way. I'm not sure if this guy's going to swing back. Guys, hunting where? Hunting here. Which is kind of bad because once he walks over here, he's actually going to spot me in this in this um, spot. More enforcers are coming. I think what I can do. I don't know where this enforcer is going. Let's see. Alright. Where are you going? You're going here. Where are you going? You're going here as well. I hope this enforcer is going this way. What I think I'm going to do is, once these guys head this way, I'll use my cloak to escape this one. Here I can actually knock both of these guys down. This guy knocked this guy down. And run, run. Yeah, and run. guy can't run or else this guy was is gonna turn around. So he'll just use cloak. I might have 
escape this level as horrendously played as I did as I uh, as horrendously as I played it I think I escaped I should have ran there actually hmm question is how much did this thing cost me and my guess is a lot let's see what I would have gotten pistol okay <laughs> um, let me guess the I killed one two three four so my cost would be like 500 I think oh 300 not bad actually did I explore everything this level um, I think I did well um, yeah so that was mission three uh, certainly not as clean as it should have been could have been would have been but uh, it's I made a risk of uh, hacking hacking turrets instead of hacking power supplies in order to avoid the demons on the power supplies and um, yeah that risk might or might not have actually paid off all right so um, I hope you enjoyed that and I'll see you next time